Morning cactus people. This is a follow-up video on the rescue cactus we got a few weeks ago. So uh, bear with me while we have a little look around. Now this is the bulk of them. Some were potted up, some uh, I took cuttings of. So, uh, all in all, a nice little connect collection there. This particular one, the um, the Puntia here has been visited by the wasps straight away. They uh, collected all the dried honeydew off it, which it's been exuding. And they were in and out day and night. Absolutely loved it. I think they've taken it all now because they've stopped. And over here, you probably remember the big um, Lenin house guy, which um, when I first put it in was leaning quite precariously so I put this um, bit of string round not tightly just to um, support it um, just in case it took a nosedive and as you can see it's moved about six inches eight inches since then so this bit of string's coming off now and he's must be geotrophic so he's, uh, he's found the right way up which is brilliant uh, down here next to him is um, a Lenin house guy that I've had for about four years, which is hardly of any size before. So we're thinking, looking at the rings and the, the size of him, probably 30 to 40 years old easily, which is a fantastic little uh, addition to the collection. And over here, the, uh, the larger cacti. I didn't have room for so uh, I put them at the back of the Apuntia bed. I'm uh, not sure on the idea of this one yet, but he's a lovely one. And another one there. And this one here was identified by one of our viewers, um, Cactus Anonymous, as um, Trichocereus deserticola, which I found is a, now called um, Echinopsis deserticola. Uh, thank you very much for the idea on that one. And this one, I do believe it's some sort of Echinopsis. Uh, this flower bud's been coming all week. It was so tiny at the beginning of the week, I wasn't sure if it was ac actually a flower bud. As you can see now, it's about eight inches long. And it's got two more buds on the way, so they should open in the next few days. And don't worry, it will shrivel up and fall off very shortly, Anders. Then we can get back to the actual plant. So don't worry about that. And another little one here. And uh, a rather interesting one there. Not sure what this one is, but uh, definite signs of life at the, um, the end of it. So, uh, absolutely brilliant. Well pleased with those rescues. And... Uh, I hope the chap who uh, grew them in the first place is looking down and uh, seeing that his plants are going to be alright for another long time, I hope. So thank you very much for joining me everyone. I'll put the um, before and after pictures on at the end of the video as usual. I'll see you in the next video.